This can look so overwhelming for someone that's never seen it and never used it. And I'm here to just be simple in this video and show you how to use the Willow Pump and most importantly, the flip to finish. That is like one of the most challenging things for Willow users. And I'm here to show you and really dissect why you have to do it the way they tell you to do it. I'm gonna show you why. Because once you know why you have to do it that way, it's just gonna be intuitive. So stay tuned. The Willow Pump is actually really easy to use. You can use it with both a container, which gives it the reusability aspect, or if you're on the go and you wanna make sure your milk does not get contaminated, you can pump straight into a bag. When you're ready to pump, what you're going to do is take your flange off obviously making sure that you've cleaned it per the instructions in the manual. You put on your flex tube and you secure it by clicking it in. You take your willow bag and you secure it into the flange. You take this part, press it in, tuck this in to the back of the flange, just like that, and then close the flange shut. When you're ready, go ahead and attach it your pump just like that and it's ready to be used if you're going to be using your reusable container you take the container off making sure it's clean and dry you insert your clean flex tube and you secure the flex tube on this end by pressing it firmly after that you want to make sure your flap is shut and your container is set to one that leaves the little ventilation hole open for proper suctioning you put it on and you're ready to pump. And I'm gonna go ahead and put this in my bra. And guys, if you're interested to know which bras go best with this pump, check out my bra video in the description box below. And please make sure to lubricate because you don't wanna end up with any wounds from using any pump, really. When you have this in and you are properly aligned, what you're gonna do, it's gonna be really simple. You're just gonna turn on the on button. The pump is on, I'm just gonna push play and it's gonna go in stimulation mode. And now it's in stimulation mode. Now once you're in stimulation and eventually in expression mode, you push the pause button and you also make sure that you switch to it too. And then you're going to need to unlatch. Okay, lights up in white, you unlatch, and you make sure you don't spill milk. I would keep it slanted forward just like this when you take it out, just so the milk inside doesn't spill. And then you switch the way the pump is facing you, okay, just like that. And then when you're ready to suck in the milk that's in the flex tube, just push the play button again. And go like this and you can even see the milk in the back of the flex tube going into your container or on your bag and if you want you don't even have to go all the way down you can just go this far because what you want that flex tube to be facing downwards releasing everything as long as the flex tube which is facing downwards right now straight down is down and releasing all the milk that's all you need they tell you to go all the way down because they want to make sure that everything has gone out of the flex tube okay no breast milk was lost in the making of this video because we know that's liquid gold and we don't mess with it this is actually cow's milk for the demonstration here. What you see here is imagine you just took out the pump and that you're holding it, if you remember, this way out of your bra. Okay, so it looks like this. As you can see here, this is before the flip to finish. The reason you have to flip to finish is because you want this milk that's left over here in the flange and the milk that's in the flex tube to actually go in your container. So you have to be careful because of that. They tell you to flip your way for just ease because you want to flip it in a way where it's just easy for your hands to maneuver. Now let me show you what is gonna happen when we start the flip. Okay, so the pump is towards you. You're on two to close the hole up so you're not spilling your milk. And this milk 
is going as you're flipping and as the pump is suctioning as it needs to be while you're flipping. See this milk right here? It's going to go, the reason it's wide towards you and we start flipping, it's gonna go in the container because gravity is also helping it in the container and it's being suctioned and you flip. And like, this is why I say you don't need to go all the flip is because now the flex tube is facing downwards. So you know for sure at this angle, at this angle, you've gotten all your milk out and it's in the container. They tell you to go all the way down just like this, just to be safe and it's easier to understand, but that's what you have to keep in mind. And then now when you hold your pump up, all the milk should be in here. I hope this helped you get a better understanding on how the willow pump works. Now remember if you're using the bag it works the same way but you're just not using the one and two switches that I showed you and if you're curious on exactly how the container works and where that suction hole is and a little bit more detail on that check out my willow container video in the description box below. Otherwise guys you are awesome and remember to be a shark. <laughs>